Tonight, we're learning more about a bizarre situation in southeast Portland. These three men stand accused of placing booby traps on a popular path. Welcome to Coin 6 News at 5 o'clock. I'm Trevor Alt. One woman was hurt by one of these devices on the I-205 multi-use path. Our Jennifer Dowling is live there now. Jennifer, this is a strange, frightening case. What exactly happened here? It is, Trevor, very scary for bikers and walkers on this path. Essentially, these men are accused of stringing a trip wire across the path. So when you hit it, uh, something bad really could happen to you. And in that case, a woman was riding through and she flew over her handlebars, seriously injuring her. Now, police say they were first called out to the path here on Friday. Officers say the trap was built across the multi-use path near Southeast Division. The victim was riding north, got entangled in the material and the force sent her over her handlebars. Officers searched the area and found more woven string south of Southeast Division along with the three men they say were responsible for all this. They were of course placed under arrest. Yeah, people that try to hurt others during the holiday season, I think that's really horrific. And that's terrible to do somebody. I don't even know how they have no knees. I'm glad I was not coming at that time. Now, all those were folks who used that path. The men who were arrested are 23 year old Justin Jones, 27 year old Antonio Tolman Duran, and 21 year old Dakota Murphy. All three were taken to the Multnomah County Jail, booked and later released. Now, they face some charges of fourth degree assault along with reckless endangering. Of course, police want to hear from you. If you ever find any material over the path here or any of the bike paths in the area, make sure to contact Portland Police. Back to you.